I know he's like a neurosurgeon or something. I'm so excited for this set. Um, as I was saying a second ago, like Lodo had a decent, some decent uh, moments against Wario, uh, but Wario was DIing for his life. Uh, he's really putting in that work to escape these Falcon bread and butters. So let's see and how Zero does with it. I think that's going to be that. Yep. And a quick one. That was good. Some good DI from Wario still. He had, he had to go out, adjust a tiny bit. Crouching on Plaid. I wonder if he's looking for like a crouch cancel or something. And look at that. Oh, dang. Quick. Scary start for Wario, but he actually kind of smiled a little bit, kind of yeah. doing that anti-tilt tech. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But this is scary, too. DIing hard in. And that DI probably saved his life. Zero just kind of electing to just give him a uh, stage there, not really pressuring him at the ledge. Swinging that up air. Oh, it almost looked like he had to grab. He dashed on him, dashed back. I don't know how the, the back air not able to follow up that tech. And yeah, not gonna crouch cancel that. Yeah, one thing that I noticed like while he played Lodo and such, if if you're off stage you don't come back. Yeah, like, but Warrior Mario was incredibly good at that. I, I think uh, Boom's Falcon is like the only one that I see like oh and tries to just call him out with the upbeat. The only one that would recover well against him, yeah. Yeah, like, uh, and even then, still, I mean, we've seen Wario put on a clinic, uh, that one Genesis, you know, that first tournament that he came to, and tries the Falcon Kick. Is he going to pay with it with his life? He is. Nice. All right, ties up the stocks. And I appreciate the attempt, you know, but you kind of deserve that, you know. <laughs> Ooh, so close with those and, bears. Yeah, nice. It's so tough, you know, because he would rather land a bear yeah. at that point. Uh, but sometimes you just have to settle for the grab if that's what he's given to you. His quick little shield slides. And some good invincibility bros there by Zero. Because that was tough, you know, scary. Just ran underneath. I've been liking that approach. It's like almost like in movies, you know, when they're running underneath like a falling... Uh, like tunnel or something. Uh, <laughs> Indiana Jones. Yeah. He goes for the slide, grabs the hat that he exactly. fell Exactly. <laughs> Wario's so good at playing just outside of that range, like, and electing yeah. to not Falcon Punch. Uh, yeah, he's got which, punch which, for it which I, I guess that 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 firebolt, you know, it really it does matter. And smart by Zero to not pressure the shield and push him off. He wanted to hit him on the other side, but Wario kind of reacted to that and was just like, yeah, I'm not going to chill here if you're not going to hit me. He avoided the plat drop fair, but couldn't grab anything off. <laughs> and that quick up air, the back part of the tail. Oh, and he doesn't get the dash forward. I love the T-Jolt there that climbs up the stage. I don't know if it really helped and him. He should go. live this. No, 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 no. Dude, the... the you said that thunder that climbed up the stage? The T-Jolt? Yeah, 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 dude. That, uh, that's the that's the coolest like, recovery where it kind of guards the, the ledge for you. Yeah. Damn, he did that on purpose, huh? I think. I don't see it a whole lot in this game. That was sick. Uh, you see it in a lot of other Smash games. Yeah, but I did I not know. even pick up on that. I, I don't think he happens. would do one accidentally there. So yeah, you're right. You're I right. like that. I, I like it a lot. It's a very specific spot, too. It's yeah. pretty tough to get the timing right. D did he get it right where it was like right where it like, got his, uh, it guarded him? Uh, he didn't, he, Zero didn't hit it or get hit by yeah. it, and he also was able to get the kill anyways, but he, uh, Zero kind of had to respect the ledge a little more. Yeah, that's awesome. It's be, But when he had oh, to throw the single it out, zap, he's going to pay for that. Yeah. Only the zip and not the zap. I love a good, uh, well-executed zip. Yeah, oh, uh, yeah, a nice zip is good. And the trade leads to a Falcon grab. Can Zero take this to death? Oh, oh see, I love that. Uh, I, lo I love that follow-up attempt though, because he just kind of missed the tech after. But it is kind of optimal. Oh, look at that di, and then the upbeat back. Reverse upbeat, so smart. It's reminiscent of when uh, Alvin came uh, to to fight Wario. If you remember, he kind of went for an edge guard, and then Alvin just fast fell underneath him and upbeat him the opposite direction. That was crazy. And then everyone that from Brazil just popped off. Shout out to the Brazilian homies. Just all of South America went crazy. I remember they were waving the flag. Yeah, and here we go. Wario trying to bring this back to a two-stock even game. And, and did, okay, I guess we didn't see Falcon recover. You know, it would have been the first time. Yeah. 
He's so good. I guess he, he did recover when he got the reverse up B. Yeah. <laughs> that's a little different, though. Yeah, true, true. That, that's a neutral win. Well, not even. It's a disadvantage win. And not able to follow up that back air. I wonder if Zero kind of DI'd at all. And did they just exchange nares? Yeah, and Wario's so good with the, the short hop. Away. Catches him going for the short hop up air. And goes for another short hop up air. And just tails him out. Going for platforms for the invincibility bros. Oh, Ooh. thought he was maybe gonna have a shield break for a sec. Okay, so there, there's a situation where he uppies this time, but he could have down air to try and go for tech chase and awesome down tilt. I love that zip zap, but just barely not enough to touch the And lid. a taunt for the fans or a messed up uh definitely messed up taunt cancel, <laughs> but it would have been a taunt either way. Amazing dare. Oh, and, and one grab. aerial takes for that forward. And that's it. Zero bet it all on just that up a, air. Man, just in the blink of an eye, you just one down air. That, yeah. that, that's it. It's a hard knock life for Falcon. Zero thinking hard. I don't think he's gonna do the ditto. It is would he gonna have go to be Kirby? the ditto. I think. I don't Why think, is he hovering over Kirby? I don't know. I don't like it though. I don't know. imagine it could. It would go that well, but maybe that's just his thinking square. That's where he puts it when he's thinking. It's possible. He's in deep thought right now. Almost thought he was asleep for a sec. I think he did really well with Falcon, though. I think even though he lost that game. I like, like to think he's just replaying the whole game in his head. Yeah. He is poor four, though, so would Maybe Wario he's be going the back one to hovering Pika. over? Nah, no. Is that oh, Wario? Oh, oh that's Wario. Uh, I think. My mistake. My mistake. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. Oh, he's debating, he's debating who to pick in case Wario counters him, Kirby. Maybe. Nah, Wario will stay Pika regardless. I think he just, so. he just looked pretty yeah. well on that. Maybe Wario hovering over Kirby was trying to make him... Maybe wants him to go for the ditto. Yeah. I think you should say Falcon. I, I think Wario hates that matchup. I think he's... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I think it's just one of those... Keeping us on wars. our toes. After much thought, we're back to square one. Did he change colors? Nope. And uh, and forward air pressure? Oh, unfortunate. Okay. That's tough. It's tough to come back. Yeah. Like, just even mentally from that. But uh, let's see if he can. This would help. This was a great string, and he had to delay. And good DI things. where he wants to get him into the platform and then tech chase. But if you can get in between those two little holes. You know, the like, needle uh, between the platforms exactly. and roll underneath one of them. Yeah. So sometimes you can almost DI too much, you know? Yeah. Oh. And look at that. He wants to come on stage, and Wario almost just guesses it out and uh, up either wrong direction. You hate to see it. Yeah. And wow, yeah, it gets that. All right, so one stock, dude, completely doable. What was I saying? It's doable, no matter what in this matchup. Just got to bring this back here. Talk to Zero before this. He told me he really wants to win this one. Yeah. And that'll do it. Had that weird DI uh, in the, at the bottom with the down air. And Wario looking pretty good here. I like him to stand on the inside of side play at the start and then maybe changes his mind. Amazing double bear. And here we go. Look at that. Good Great DI. NDI there by Wario. And that's what I'm talking about. He, Oh, and he just had to, I guess because the up he went the other direction. Oh, that would have been awesome. He acts like he's going for the up to kind of call him out up top. Ledge canceled it. That was so sick. And the weak nair. He tries to get a down air after, and he wants the up air hook. Is the back throw going to kill? It's not. Not yet. Amazing recovery again. What is that angle? I guess he was trying to grab ledge again, but he yeah. just lands back on stage and is just like. Great matchup. We got some applause this time. I feel oh, like CTG and 